It's July 3rd. It's July 3rd. Okay. We're ready to keep going. New loadout. What's new? I don't remember. Oh, I got I got a new a new one of these. Didn't I? Was it cooking? No. Oh, I got the fire pot. I remember now. This is definitely not a new recorded session. <laughs> okay. Uh, I think honestly, I, I I think I'm ready. I think I'm ready to have the ethereal pots. All three of the ethereal pots. Now remember, with the pots, I only need to match two instead of three. But the specific color that it's in is the only one that will count as matches. All right, I gotta remember that. That's the easiest way for me to hey, what you reading? mess things up. Oh, I'm just perusing the new expertise tome I bought from Louie and Louie. Expertise? Yes, it's the study of a particular esoteric cooking style or technique. You should really take a look into some. Judges award bonuses for demonstrating the use of expertises. Here, you can have one of mine. I've got the contents of that tome committed to memory. Okay. So we have the ex apprentice expertise of butcher. Waste not, want not. Uh, expertise bonus. Serve a dish containing all ingredient types from your matching themes ingredient. Okay. So I guess if we have this equipped and we, we cook every single one of the ingredients available for whatever the theme is, really? we get bonuses. Wow. Thanks, Kieran. You're welcome. If you don't mind, though, I have to get back to studying. Okay. So do I have to equip that? Uh, combat? No cooking yeah i have to equip it okay so let's see I, I'm, I'm ultimately just guessing which which ingredient i'll need uh let's go yeah let's do it all right oh inspect the bookcase curious this one's about the brigade three branches of the brigade are research military and ambassador in Erdaston. Oh, that's right. It's a new day, so we can do new jobs. Let's do let's 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 do what we what we know best. Oh, that's not it. <laughs> that's definitely not it. Let's go to the restaurant. Mina Han reporting for duty. Right on time. I've got a new tail ready for you once you finished your shift. Get to it. Yes, chef. Here we go. Alright. So I don't want to say I've been practicing this. But outside in the main menu, there's a there's a way for me to do this. I want to say over and over. That's that's actually not correct. Uh, there's ways for me to do this as like a daily challenge, I believe it is. And I'm not too bad at this, to be honest. I'm pretty good at, at moving this one, as we've already seen several times over and over. Not often I toot my own horn, but this horn needs tooting. There we go. I'm sure there's faster ways I can do these, but I'm not doing it so slow. I'm not doing it so bad. Like it's requiring me to stop and think if I'm gonna talk at the same time. There we go. There we go. This isn't too bad. Thank you. I'm genuinely, it's been a while. It's been a while since I've genuinely enjoyed a game. But ladies and gentlemen, this is it right here. Right. This looks so good. Let's get that blue one over there. Green. I'm killing it. I told y'all your boy Chill is killing it in the kitchen. Let's see this one where it's just it's just the five pieces. This one's annoying. <laughs> I cannot lie, this one's annoying. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's get that one there. There we go. Yep. Delicious. All right. Oh, thanks. Killing it. All right. No, it's it's better than all right. I made it. Play with me. Oh, thanks. What do you think this is? Oh shoot. Here we go. Not gonna make it. Not gonna make it. Very ah. Then what happened? He pointed to the scar on his arm and revealed that it wasn't the mark of a monster, but an enraged opponent. 
Whoa, just because they lost the match? Mm-hmm. There's no honor in such an act. Whoops. It's later than I realized. I've got to get going. I'll see you tomorrow, Pontita. All right. So there's one job done. We can head back to uh, we head back to the puzzle. Which one was puzzle again? What are we doing here? Oh, I think I remember it. I think I'm. Uh, yeah, I remember exactly what we have to do. Okay. I've got a slew of real noggin twisters here. I'm so glad you showed up. What's the issue? Oh, getting the essences out of dishes is getting more complicated the further down my <coughs> list I go. Well, let's try our best. I don't suppose you've used these fancy sauces much before, have you? Well, no, my family's menu has a very straightforward style. Not to worry, saucing a dish just changes the flavor of the topmost gems it lands on. Sauce is perfect when you've got too many of the wrong taste gems. Wow, that sounds really useful. Okay, so that's something that we actually learned already when it comes to uh, the, the, the hunting portion. If we drop these here, it'll turn the red and the green gem into blue gems. And then we go get up. All right, so let's see, what is that, egg? Oh, okay, I'm about to say, wait, eggs? Work like sauces? That's interesting. That is interesting. Okay. So we need to get to third. I'm sorry, to 50. We have 30 points. Uh, what will happen is whatever the earthen sauce hits, it will turn the left one into red and the right one into green. And then eggs will turn anything into blue. Okay. So we need to be careful here. Uh, I guess we want to change the two blue ones, right? So we need to set this up so that the blue ones will be the ones that get hit. All right. And then if we drop the earth and sauce right in the middle. And then we go get out right here. There we go. All right, so for these two, we have verse get blood and eggs. So verse get blood will, it's one and it'll change into red. Okay. So I'm guessing we want to change a green into a red and then hit both of the, hit uh, two greens with the eggs as well. I th actually, I think we could get away with just the eggs. We need to get from 12 to 30. Let's see. What I'm going to do is we'll cook for a little bit and move that like that. And then I think if I drop the eggs in the middle, we'll have enough for six red and three blue and then three green. So now it's just a matter of moving things. Red. And then that one there. Oh, did I not do it right? Oh, I don't think I did it right. Oh, no. I messed up. I messed up somewhere. Okay, let's try it again. Actually, let's see what verse get blood does before I start over. Yeah, it's only going to move the one. Okay. Whoops. All right, so let's start over. Let's try again. Again, we have verse get blood in eggs. Let's get blood and eggs. Interesting. Huh. I'm actually, I'm actually confounded here. Let's see. So do I want a green? No, I think I want, I, it looks to me like I want to change these two the two blue or the two greens but that ain't work right what happens quick question what happens if i hit that green one that that level two green with first get blood what happens then ah okay okay 
So if it's a level two, it'll stay a level two. It doesn't revert to level one, even if I change the color of it. Okay, so that means I do want to hit these with the eggs. Now I want to do like that. So I can have two level, I'm uh, sorry, three level twos. Okay, understanding. That's dope. Thinking like that, and you'll be a master gastronomist in no time. Okay. Okay. I'm learning. I'm doing a little bit of learning today. All right. So all that's left now is the hunt. Let's do the hunt, and then maybe we could buy something else from Louie and Louie. Watch yourself, girl. Otsu is missing, and he's very crafty. Not to mention deadly. Who's Otsu? Well, now we may begin. Oh, cool. She has a pet snake. I would never. A good hunter is always in tune with the ecosystem. You must be prepared to both nurture it and benefit from it. Hunt a beast and I'll show you what I mean. Gather an ingredient from the squickle. All right. Got these blades for you, fam. Possible. Drop the ingredient at your feet. I drop it like that. Now that the bait is set, we'll wait for a cheap cheat to arrive. Remember that you can drop ingredients you don't want during matches. So now we can attack the cheap cheat. After cheap cheats have been fed, they lay eggs. Okay, so we're not going to attack the cheap cheat. Eggs are a naturally high value ingredient. They contain, they can be turned into a sauce with an attack. Instructor, eggs are my favorite food. I know how to. Did I ask for your commentary? No instructor. All right, so we laid an egg. And I want to attack it. Grab the egg. That was decent. Now go find a few more eggs so I can whip up a breakfast omelet. Okay, so that's, that, I, that's actually super interesting, you know? Like, I never would have thought. This game is so clever. This game is so clever. I commend this game. Okay, so this is what we want to grab and drop, right? Let's see. So here's an egg. So we want to drop that. A cheap shield come along. Cheap chi. Where y'all ass is at? <laughs> oh, there it is. Okay, so there's a cheap chi. Let's feed him. Mm, God damn it. I'm going to murder you. I'm going to murder you. While I wait for this cheap chi. All right, so it drops an egg. And another egg. I wonder. I wonder what all other, uh, what other beast I can do this with. How was that, instructor? <sighs> Your form needs work. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So all that's left now is to challenge someone. Uh, let's actually go to the shop first. Lichen spice. It smells like fresh pine and peat moss. I wonder if I'm missing something. I feel like there's a way for me to know a little bit of info about what we're going to be making before we get there. Uh, let's see. This here is for five bone ingredients. Bone is good. Bone gave me the wild card. Let's buy bone. Let's buy that. And then we have apprentice expertise ingredient master serve a dish that contains the same ingredient five times oh i've done that several times i'm getting that one actually i want to use that instead of the other the other expertise i want to use that let's see uh green ingredients we found actually a lot of those let's maybe switch the bone with the griffin talons all right maybe i'm doing myself for today okay who are we gonna challenge can we challenge uh, Thrash? I don't, I, have I fought Trash already? Uh, Thrash already? I don't know if there's a way for me to keep track of who I've fought or who I've who I've battled. Let's see, who's this guy? We haven't we haven't we haven't done combat with this guy yet. Let's let's go with him. Want a duel? I was just about to ask you. I remember you from the end, but I never caught your name. People are talking about a man named Siegfried who tamed the slime. Is that you? 
I guess. Most people just call me Ziggy. My pal here is a ghost, though. Slimes don't make for very interesting company. Right. Well, it'll be a pleasure to duel, Ziggy. You got it. All right, we ready? We ready. Let's go. I'm hyped. Let's do this today. <laughs> Your funeral. Let's do this one. I'm all ready for the cooking. I'm all ready for the cooking. All right, it's going to be my first battle. It's going to be my first battle in a while. Here we go. We're at the Kitchen Coliseum, ladies and gentlemen. It's another glorious day in the Kitchen Coliseum, and our contestants are becoming more skillful with each dish they prepare. Much like the fire in our chef's hearts, the spirit of this tournament burns ever brighter. This small town chef has become something of a crowd favorite. Please welcome the Iron Stomach, Mina. <laughs> This cryptic competitor employs a band of skeletal sous chefs. He calls himself Ziggy, the fast food fiend. <laughs> Who's ready to clog their arteries? <laughs> Ziggy. The next judge is the famed Grand Matriarch, Asjil. With each challenge that passes, these chefs reveal more of themselves through their creations. I look forward to learning more today. Some chefs mistake Earth for the most simplistic energy, but its purity belies subtle complexities. Bring me a dish that harnesses its potential. Today we welcome back Ambassador Akebo to the judges' platform. Ah, what a fine day for a match. I'm anxious to taste today's dishes. At the annual fire festival, local food stands make spicy kebabs that are out of this world. I'd like to see the contestants bring that kind of fiery flavor to today's challenge. Ha -ha. Okay, so before I press the A button, I've done a daily challenge, and I probably shouldn't have done it so early because I learned something. Uh, when I have two judges, I have to make two meals. I have to bring them each a meal. Asking, of course, for what they what they desire. In my youth, I refused to eat this beast's meat out of fear its curse would pass to me. Like our ancestors, I fear what I didn't understand. Luckily, our chefs today are fearless in the face of the unknown. Let's see what they can do with Burskit. I gotta take on that. I gotta hunt things from that. Okay. Okay, here we go. Vive la brigade. Okay, here we go. So I need two I need two things. I need one of earth and one of fire. Luckily, we got both those pots. Uh oh that's right. The winds. Oh! There they are! There they are! Alright, so we got Versket Tail here, we got Oh God. Oh God, I dropped my things. If I drop from the earth, that makes me sad. All right, verse get tail. All right, so I'm gonna have to explore this land a little bit to understand what I have about me. We got watery sauce. Oh no, oh no, this gen is back. How about, there we go. Oh, this is a different one. He's got, wait, did the other one have ice spikes? I don't remember. Uh oh, shoot, out of magic. I don't remember if he had ice spikes or not. I just remember you gonna murder me. Ah, oh, shoot, I don't have enough magic. All right, here we go. Here we go with the nonsense. Get out of there, get out. Oh, never mind, don't get out of there. Let's see, armor rock. Okay, so this is water. I need to not deal with him. Oh, first get, there we go. First get in the building. No. Drop that over there. Oh, God. They're taking it from me. They're taking it from me. I can leave those. 
Uh, uh, yeah, let's leave those. Actually, that's bone. Let's take that. I guess we could take this too, since they ain't back here. Okay, there we go. Let's grab that. All right, let's go cook. Let's go cook. We need to make one of the meals so far. Okay, what we got? What we got? We got earth. Okay, so let's start with that. That one there. Oops, cook for me. Cook for me while I put these things in. Oh my god. Why are we not cooking? Why are we not cooking? Cook! There we go. Come on. Oh shoot, this is the fire pot. Oh, I'm a cloud. Who saw this and knew immediately what was about to happen? Who knew I was gonna monk it all up? Let's go to the the earth pot. Cook! And we can throw these in there too. All right, so while that's cooking there, I can come over here. Let's see, let's throw this in. And then, oops, and we also put in some armor rock ribs. And we cook that bad boy. And what we need to do, we actually need to rotate that sucker. Oh no, those aren't the right ones. Okay, to save me some room, I'm gonna put that in there for now. Cook for me, cook for me one time. Let's stir this bad boy up. Okay. There we go. All right. So we're making a masterpiece already. That's okay. That's our, that's clearly our green meal. We're going to need to make more red in here. So let me go get some more ingredients. Let me go get some more ingredients. Oh, look at that. Verse get tail already. Okay, so that's how they come out. I got to tell them to come out. Get out here. No? All right, fine. We'll go find the other one. We'll go find the other one. Where'd the other one go? There we go. Get out here. Get out here, y'all. I'm hungry. I'm not hungry. I'm trying to cook. I'm trying to cook it up one good time. Come on. We need to not fall. All right. Let's throw some more. Let's see. We need red in here. Oh, we ain't got too much red. Okay. There we go. No. There we go. You seen Joey? No. Why? Sometimes he likes to wonder into other people's cookware and explode their creations. I'm sure it won't happen this time. Cook. Uh. Right, I'm not paying attention to this man. I'm not paying attention to this man. He's trying to skirt. He's trying to skirt on by. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to move you suckers here. You're going to come over here real quick. Gook for me one good time. Gook it up. Now, that's supposed to be the red meal, so I need to be very careful. I need you. Oh, shoot. There's too much blue in here. I think, honestly, I think I need to just throw this away. How can I just throw it away? I can't. Oh, let's add this in here. I hope this is a smart. I hope this is a smart. Cook for me. I still need to go. Let's see. Let's figure out what meal this is first. This is the red pot. Oh, my God. What do we need? <laughs> okay, this is clearly the green meal. Let's go get some red. Let's go get some red. Come on, y'all suckers. Come on, y'all suckers. What you got? I bet you won't. I bet you won't. All right, we're going to need to get a lot more tails. Come on, move out my way. Get out my face. Ugh, there we go. Now, what's over here? Nothing? Nothing? Is that just an elaborate trap? Come on. There's something up. There's clearly something still up from here. I'll go there in a second. Oh, Jesus. Okay. I need to make sure at least this meal is dope. There we go. Looking pretty dope to me. I'm not going to mix up the blues anymore. We're just going to let that one sit there. Uh, we absolutely need to start on the red meal now. Oh, we got tails, bruh. Oh, we got tails, bruh. Cook it up. Cook it up for me one good time. All right. I need to mix this. need to mix this sucker. And then those should go. Yeah, we need to put a little bit more stuff in there. Let's see. Um, if we go to the pantry, put in some more red. Oh, fuck. Am I doing the wrong thing? Actually, no, those are bones. Those are bones. I actually want those. Okay. I need to I need to mix this one. That's what it is. I don't think I can leave here anymore and have a good meal. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Here's how we're going to do it. We got one minute left. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, and we're going to go ahead and give this one to uh, this judge. Here you go. We're going to lock that sucker in. Let's stir this one up. Uh, let's see. What we can actually do. Uh, 
Shoot. Watery sauce. Watery sauce. Okay, I'm not worried about the sauce. Damn, there's too much stuff in here. I'm probably going to have to... All right, let's see. Do I have enough time to go grab some red to, to make this one a little bit more ready? I did that on purpose. Here we go. One more, one more. And then this here. Okay, so there's a little bit of red. We need to be quick. We need to be quick. We're not going to do so hot with that judge. All puns intended today. Shoot. I think I just got to. Yeah. We just got to take this pot. That's just going to be it. That's that fire fire meal. Not so good. The earth. I think we got Thank it. Thank you for your hard work, chefs. Let's see what the judges have to say about your efforts. I literally just served him vermin tail. Or versket tail. Congratulations. Alright, so from Ziggy to the Earth Judge, we got squickle stomach and guts dipping sauce. Served with iceberg turnip and versket tail assortment. Earth is the perfect stabilizer. You've captured it beautifully in this dish. A respectable dish. I'm pleased with your work. You're an inspiration. And then from me, we got Versket Tail Vermicelli. Garnished with emerald grass and armor rock heart assortment. Your interpretation of this dish is my favorite by far. Plenty of earth sp uh, evenly spread throughout. Using the same ingredients so frequently was a risky move, but you've excelled at bringing out its variety. You've managed to expertly combine your flavors in this dish. The clever twists and turns are as compelling as any novel. All right. So between me and Ziggy with the Earth Judge, we I won. He's got uh for the this is the Fire Judge slime egg sundae garnished with scow breast and wind fruit medley. This is gonna be interesting because it's glowing blue. Now if I'm if I'm not if I'm not mistaken, this gonna be good. I was looking forward to fire, but it's not the first flavor to hit my tongue. To achieve that, fire must have the most top quality gems in your dish. Yeah, he's got more blue than, than red, more water than fire. I don't dislike your dish, but it might not be spectacular enough to triumph in the finals. I hope we did. <clears throat> oh, dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> Him saying, oh, dear, does not go well. I'm I'm tasting the fiery perfection I was looking for. Using the same ingredients so frequently was a risky move, but you've excelled at bringing out its variety. The flavor is good, but I know you can improve upon it next time. Yeah, I ain't think this went through. I very clearly didn't think this went through. I served him rodent tail. Another stunning victory for the Iron Stomach. And I still dominated over the fast food freak. I think that's what it was. Mina Ha wins. I did it. Z, you trash, bro. <laughs> Damn. I, I, I served this man verse get tail. Like, I went out and hunted the things, put them on a plate. It served them to this man. I apologize. Genuinely sorry on this day. You're a necromancer? Isn't that unsanitary for our line of work? Just because I get assistance from the undead doesn't mean I don't have standards. I wear gloves. I've heard stories about this kind of magic, but I thought it was evil. No offense. Huh. You and the committee. Apparently, I've got them all wild up. They want to add a new rule just to kick me up. Pretty boring culinary experts, if you ask me. They don't even want to put haunt cuisine in their mouths. Hmm. I understand their concerns. I got a jet, but look for me if you ever want to try haunt cuisine. I hear you're a brave soul. Um, sure. Thanks for the match. Sayonara. Wait, you ain't got no gift for me? I'm scared to know what his food's made of. He that mad that I beat him that he doesn't have a gift for me? Oh, never mind. I'm sorry. <laughs> Ziggy spicy ketchup. When you're dying for some spice, he gives me uh, two red sauces to start with. Not bad. Not bad at all. I can't believe this man was mad that I beat him.
All right. So the end of another wonderful day. I think it's it'd be best to go and retire. I think it'd be best to retire. What was this? Huh. I never noticed this bowl before. Does the innkeeper have a pet? Oh, may I be of service? Good morning, lad. Off to another day of battle. Yeah, sure. All right, he ain't got nothing to talk about. We gonna go to the room. We gonna get us some sleep, and then we're gonna we're gonna come back tomorrow, and we're gonna cook it up. We're gonna cook it up more tomorrow. It's been a long day. Everyone's cuisines are so different here. I'm going to have to give it everything I've got to make mine stand out. Yeah, I actually do need to do better. That was that was horrible. That second meal was horrible. I bet Kiki and Simon would know what to do. They'd have a joke ready and everything. 